My name is Douglas Bateman. I haven't really... Um, I've tried to involve myself on different levels here. So I've engaged as a performer for, for um, Cecile and the young. And then I engaged myself as a teacher offering dance classes or ideas of movement research classes for non-professionals. And then I engage myself in the forum challenging structure because um, as an artist, which relate, for me it related a lot to Jan Janusz, 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 Janusz. Yeah. Um, his work about, you know, what is your role as an artist? And, my role as an artist, in the definition of my role, it's um, I get money to make artwork in that essence, in a way. And so how do I, what do I do with money? How do I, what is the thing that I do? And um, one of the things we do is, of course, we try to be artists. And we try to think, the collective, the Michael Douglas Collective, we try to think differently about working together and that's not just between us, the dancers, the performers, but between the people around the collective, between the artists in the city, between free groups and institutions. Um, as we know in Germany, you know, the institution for dance, the Stadttheater, has been crumbling. You know, money is leaving the Stadttheater, dance companies are closing, there's very few dance companies, there's far fewer jobs money for dance than there was, you know, ten, five years ago. And um, so we're looking at how we can collaborate and share what money and what power and what energy there is to, to give dance a relevance and a resonance in today's society. That's why I work with people that aren't dancers, to engage them in contemporary dance and psychological dance. Um, and challenging structures, because I, I met a wonderful French man, and I, I asked him, you know, what, what's your experience of institutions and art? And he just looked at me and said, institutions kill art. And I'm like, well, so we're going to have to find a way to keep art alive in this institutional world. That's that. And then the other thing I'm very obsessed about is the word network, the social network how we communicate with each other, you know, we communicate with Facebook, we communicate with SMS. And Facebook is just, it's called the social network. So I'm very interested in what that relevance, what the relevance is of communication between us now and, you know, that whole thing. Triangle is set up with a individualized um, profile system. All the artists were asked to fill in a profile to make pictures, to give reports. Basically, a private Facebook. And I, I can kind of express more than you can express. I, we're the same, you know. I just, I trained. I'm, I trained in dance, but I'm trained in theatrical presentation. So I'm used to being watched by people. I'm used to being on a stage or in front of a group of students. So I know the codes of how that works, but apart from that, you know, I really, I really do believe that we all can enjoy the, the is it Heitigkeit, the joy, the, 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 the amazingness of just dancing, you know. I, I, I think the, 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 the same value of dancing at home to your favourite song, in the kitchen or your bedroom or your living room, is exactly what I do. I just much more trained and you know and then I try to bring in more people by performing on a stage and maybe telling a story of, of you know that's important to life important to the world important to society you know the role of the artist so that's what I consider but yeah we're all the same you know if I, we're dancing in the then you know with the band sisters you know these amazing hip-hop girls no that's not the band sisters they're called neutrospective Yes, and there are a group of young girls and they work in the community centres. I mean, um, the guys in the um, Jugendzentrum. Yeah. And, you know, we dance together. 
I do class with them and they're doing their own work and I don't see any discrepancy, there's no difference between what they do and what I do. Well, I offered, I just tell you what I did, I offered a non-verbal forum, for non -verbal, so it was just a couple of exercises, um, not talking but communicating without words. Um, I offered <laughs> talking trees, which was a body scan, a 45 minute body scan where you just let go of your body and you sink and you, you practice letting go of matter and maybe a bit of spirit or a bit of tension. Um, training, what else? And then structure, but the structure, it wasn't really a project, it was sort of a, it was like annoying everyone somehow. Like that was kind of what I did, I just annoyed everyone or just pissed everyone off. But actually, it did change. And after a week or so, it just happened anyway, so I'm not sure what my role was in that, if that's a real project. It's my project that I'm doing outside the triangle, but it's maybe not a real project inside the triangle. But who knows? Maybe it's an invisible project. <laughs>